Pretty awesome, right? Screen mirror your iPhone to your Roku. Completely free, no need to download anything on your iPhone. Everything is just built into it. And just to give you an example, we'll be using the screen mirroring feature on your iPhone. Really simple, really easy. So let's just dive right into it. All right, so the first thing you wanna do on your iPhone, really simple by the way, is just make sure your iPhone is connected to your home Wi-Fi. Just make sure your iPhone is connected to your home Wi-Fi or the Wi-Fi or the network that is available to you. So in this case, you can use Hotspot as well. So go to your settings page. Now inside the settings page, make sure you connect, make sure your iPhone is connected to your home Wi-Fi. In this case, that is my home Wi-Fi and that is pretty much all you have to do. Okay, so the first thing you wanna do as we just did on the iPhone is to go into your network settings on your Roku Express. Really simple, really easy. So inside the network settings, go into your setup connection. Click on wireless and it should automatically give you the option to connect to your specific network. So in this case, it's gonna be my home network. So just wait a couple of seconds so it can actually load up all the networks available. In this case, that is my home network. And as you can see, all you have to do is just click okay and enter the password. And that is pretty much all you have to do. As you can see, it is connected and it is excellent right now. Okay, as you can see, it is connected and it is excellent. So now what you wanna do is go back into your now go back into your settings page. Inside these settings, go to your Apple AirPlay settings into your Roku Express settings. So it's really easy, nothing fancy at all. By the way, I'll be linking a website in the description box below, so be sure to check it out. So go all the way down to Apple AirPlay and HomeKit, really simple. And inside it, it should look exactly like this, literally exactly like this, okay? And that's where the fun begins, okay? Now, once you're on this screen, all you have to do is take your iPhone out scroll down and all you have to do is click on the screen mirroring and as you can see it should automatically give you the option for the roku in this case that is my roku at the top just click on it and bam we are connected it might ask you for the code if you're doing for the first time but yeah it's pretty pretty awesome pretty simple and again you can do tons of this you can even use your camera if you want to as you can see i'm using the live camera you can take photos you can even view photos if you want to so let me just open up as you can see that is my computer and that is the roku but yeah it's pretty amazing how this works so i hope you enjoyed it and the way you stop this is really simple just click on the dynamic island or if you don't have the dynamic island go into your control center click on that and click on stop mirroring and you don't have to open and you don't have to open the airplay every single time so let's check this out so go to your home and uh, now you don't have to now you don't have to manually enable the apple airplay every single time all you have to do is just screen mirroring go to your screen mirroring all you have to do just bam we are connected and if you want to disconnect really simple just click on stop and that is pretty much it. If you wanna do it again, click on it, click Roku, and that, there you go. <laughs> pretty awesome, right? Well, if you have any questions, do let me know in the comment section below. I'm, I'm Riz and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out.